Hello, everyone. It's time for the silly little fruit game. Oh man, face rig. I have to use face rig for this stream again. I, I feel like I've gone backwards in life. Um, be because I, uh, I have to use my phone to, to play the game. So, um, now I have to go back to having just terrible face tracking. Hello? Like, do you not know where my lips are? Can you not handle my lips? Is this... Whatever. Anyway. Why does the chat look a little... Hold on. I feel like the chat thing does not fit very nicely in there. I just... Womp. Womp. Makes me a little happier now. Do you care? Probably not. I care, though. I care, and that's what matters. Today we play the fil silly little fruit game, that's it. That's the stream, baby. Um, it's mostly just gonna be me vibing and uh, d demanding watermelon. I have not gotten a single watermelon in this game and I'm really upset about that. So, my goal is to get a watermelon. Okay, face rig, you are pissing me off. What? <sighs> I 
you know what? Give me one sec. I'm gonna I'm gonna demand face rig be nice to me. Give me one sec. Okay, so I um I threatened Face Rig's life with um with a with a weapon and it might work a little better now. Man, the mouth tracking is still really off though. Oh god, this is annoying. Uh you know what? I don't care. That's it. I don't care. You know what I'm talking, and that's because you hear my voice. Does my mouth move? No. And do you wanna know why my mouth doesn't move? It's because instead of saying my thoughts out loud, I am simply beaming them directly into your skull. I'm that powerful. So don't worry about it. Anyways, fruit game. It's fruit game time. Let's go. Yes. Um, so this game has been ruining my life. It's been ruining everyone's lives. Um, it's J June's fault that I play it. It's June's fault. If you know about this game, it's probably June's fault. Like, he definitely... I feel like he's the pioneer that brought this to the West. <laughs> Him, I am. Himself. I, I am... I single-handedly introduced... You single-handedly injected this, like... Heroin-like game into, into the lives of your friends. Mm -hmm. Um... It's called, um... How do you say it again? He Cheng Da Xi Gua. He Cheng Da Xi Gua. I don't speak Chinese, so that was probably really awful. Um, which translates most directly to synthetic watermelon. Synthetic big synthetic watermelon. Synthetic big watermelon, which sounds really bad. <laughs> and June was like, I don't know what to call it. So I said, well, let's see if there's other like words that that synthetic word means that maybe makes a little more sense and one of them was uh fusion so i was like how about like watermelon fusion and that's how uh we came up with watermelon fusion it's not i don't there's no like official translation of the name so i've decided that's the official translation of the name it is officially called watermelon fusion change my mind one of these days, some developer, some app developer, is going to find this game, and they're going to make it, and they're going to put it up on the app store with ads, and they're going to sell, like, little cheats for 99 cents, and... Someone already made a version of cheats for free. Someone already made a version with cheats for free, but the, someone's going to release it in the app store in the West. Mm -hmm. Some Western developer is going to see this, they're going to steal the idea, and they're, like, they're just going to throw it out there. And you and I, and all of us, are gonna know that they are a, a mean person who stole this idea from WeSane.com. <laughs> we WeSane! We I'm sure it's pronounced like Wesane. 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 I'm sorry, I don't speak Chinese. I just- I think it's really funny to read it as WeSane. Because it makes it sound like the people who made this are trying to like, no, no, don't worry, we're like, we're, we're normal, we're sane. Like, they just want to reassure you about that. Um. I really enjoy how slow this console Why are you playing it on your computer anyway? Fun. Okay. Well, yeah, so another thing is this isn't an app. You would think, oh, this is on a phone. This is not an app. I'm, I'm currently playing this in Safari on my phone. It doesn't work on Chrome. I don't use the Safari browser on my phone because I think the Safari browser is poo. But, um... It doesn't work on Chrome. It, it, it doesn't. It also doesn't work on a computer. So, don't even bother. Hey, FaceRig, stop that. It does work, but you need to have the most extreme gaming computer. 
Yeah, so like for some reason this game like kind of saps the resources of computers. It also kind of saps the resources of your device too. Like it's not a very well made game at all. It's kind of frightening. I don't quite understand why it's not an app. Like, it's very strange. I... Maybe there's something about the app development scene in China that I don't know. Maybe it's more reasonable to release an app like this than to try to get it on the app store. No, I don't think it is because when I looked it up, there was like an article about it and it was like, for some reason this isn't on the app store that I'm obsessed with it. Okay, all right so then. I think it's weird. Okay, yeah. it's even weird for them. Okay, I didn't know like what Chinese Apple is like, what the Chinese app store is like. I just know China's kind of got their own version of everything going, so I didn't know if it would be a whole thing. My phone is, like, warm. Mm. I hope my phone, like, explodes or something during this stream. That would be so fun. Okay. I, um, have never gotten a watermelon, so my dream for this stream, um, more like my, my, uh, sort of torture idea for this stream Hello, Arca! Hi, Arca! Arca, I heard you're streaming tonight. I saw your your streaming tonight. Is that still true? Because I... I want to watch your stream. And I think I will, somehow. Even though I'm streaming. It will happen. I'm not- I don't know if I'm winning yet. I'm hoping to get a watermelon. I've never gotten a watermelon before. And all I want out of this stream is to get a watermelon. Have you I, ever gotten a half watermelon? I have gotten a half watermelon, but I've never made a whole watermelon. Mm, okay. So my goal is if I, I am not allowed to end this stream until I get a whole watermelon. I got a watermelon. <laughs> Go fuck yourself. You're also playing on a computer, which is cheating because it gives you more space. So go fuck yourself, Mr. Pendragon. Don't rub it in my face. Get, get over there. Come on, stupid lemons. Also, I want to talk about the Kiwi in this game. Now, the Kiwi, once once you begin to, like, get into the game, like, a little bit more, like, once it stops being, like, a mindless tapping it and, like, combining the same fruits together and, like, assuming that you will win because you have combined the same fruits kind of vibe. Um, something you'll notice is the importance of the Kiwi. The Kiwi- the game- I managed to get one and a half melons last night. I'm so proud of you, Arca. Oh, that's my limit, too. I, I'm trying to get to two melons. That's my goal. Oh god, I hate you that's people. My goal. <sighs> um... The... The Kiwi is very important. You need to make Kiwi. Like, th that is really the true goal. The mm. Kiwi is the last fruit you can make. With the fruit that you drop. I mean, I guess- I guess the tomato you can make with kiwis, but it's not the same. Your goal is to make kiwis, because kiwis fuse into tomatoes, which fuse into peaches, which fuse into pineapples, which fuse into coconuts, which fuse into watermelons. But also there's something very remarkable about the kiwi that you'll notice. The kiwi rotates on its own. It is the only fruit capable of movement on its own. There are times when a single rotating kiwi will create like almost like gears among the fruit. And this sometimes will even cause enough of a chain reaction to like move the fruit out of nowhere. It's it's very it's very um It's very impressive. It's quite a trait. I wish to be a kiwi. I'm glad you do. Arca, are you gonna be streaming tonight? Because I will watch your stream. I don't know how I'm gonna do it, but I'm gonna do it. Hello to Maki! What is up? Hi, Russians. <laughs> Hi, I'm not Russian. Who's Russian? Uh, are Tamaki is Russian. The Russians, in your brain? Russians only? Like, am I- is that not- is that hello not for me? Discussing watermelon fusion tactics. Yes, my tactic is to calculate the kiwis I need and to plan my life accordingly. You you plan your life. Yes. I see. Want to stop by a bit before? That's so valid. I I will watch your stream somehow, Arca. Don't worry about it. It will occur. I will be there somehow. 
I will be there. Maybe I'll do a watch party of your stream on my stream while I'm playing yes. this game at the same yes. time. Yes, yes, yes. I don't I really know how I could set that up, but I'll make it happen. I love Watermelon this Fusion game. reminds me of 2048, so I just use more or less the same tactic. I have never played 2048 before, and I, I don't- I'm too afraid to ask what what it is by this point. You've never played 2048? I've never played it. Nope. Uh -huh. Yes, I got a half a watermelon! Woo! Okay, okay. Guys, we're making some progress. I'm glad, of course. I, I would- Arca, I would die for you. I want you to know that. Okay. I'm making progress. It's like progress, but it's also poggies. Yes! I'm so sorry. It's so using numbers together just like watermelon fusion does with fruits. Sammy infected like 80 of our friends with this disease. I'm so happy <laughs> to hear that. Good. How many people do you think you spread it to its total, Timothy? Can you count for me? Count? You want the poor man to do math? Yes. Yes. That's rough. Yes. There's a certain method that's best to win the game, so I sort of do the same here. I like 20, I sent it in a huge group chat. What is- what is the method, Arca? Am I not doing it? Am I- am I- have I, this whole time, been doing it wrong? But watermelon fusion is admittedly harder because the fruits take up space and have physics. That's valid. Oh, I gotta- I- oh, I'm so I wanna close. try the version with someone made in cheats. Because I- I, I really wanna try the cheat mode version of it. What happens if I get a watermelon, like, soon? Do I just end the stream right then and there? No. Okay, okay. I'll end the stream to get a watermelon name for two. Ugh. Wow, what a mindset you have, June. That's exhausting. I think so. I like to aim low. You know? That's kind of my strategy as a person. Oh, I got one and a half watermelons. Oh, wow. Good for you. Is to arrange the things from biggest to largest so when it fuses, it can all do it in one go. Smallest to largest English bat. That's okay. English is an evil language, and I understood it anyways, so it's- it's okay. Somehow my brain was like biggest to largest, smallest to largest? Yeah. I don't know, I- I live in- I- I- My brain is a special little hell zone. It's a very special little zone. It's cause I've got diseases. Why is my model broke as shit? Whoa. It looks like my model's having a seizure. You good, queen? Um, Face Rig is just saying no today. Face Rig is always saying no every day. You know what? Switch your beauty. Not even that. Oh. I have a better idea. Are you going to do nothing? No. I will. I will be Podcat. Yes! 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 I love the podcast thing. Okay, I'm sorry. It really gets me. It really it really fires me up. Um I I can't steal June's VTube Studio because we use my phone for VTube Studio. Uh which is the one I'm using right now to play I the steal watermelon I's game. VTube Studio yeah. because I don't I cannot afford an iPhone. <laughs> How is Lonely Screen treating you? It's treating me alright. It's treating me well, I guess. Thank you for the recommendation. I did not realize it was just one of those free things that, um... I didn't realize... Yeah, I, I, I do see that it pops up every once in a while, but it does not affect the stream, so I don't really care. It would be annoying if I was trying to watch it, but I'm not, and it doesn't affect how it's captured, so I don't care. Oh wow, that was a bad place for that kiwi. Oops. Bad kiwi decisions. No! Why did you roll that way? F fuck you. Fuck you, sir. 
Now I've got tomatoes in bad places. Yes! Okay. Woo! All right, that was good. That was good. That was good. We're doing okay. Maybe. <laughs> I always I always get to the first half of the watermelon, and then I fall apart. I still think it's really ridiculous how the person who made the cheat version rewrote this game and posted it in an hour. Honestly, I, just, I, 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 if you know how to make games, this game is probably so easy to make. This game, there's no way this game took more than a day to make. Like, for sure. Uh... I was thinking it would be really fun. This music makes me feel like Nagito Kamida in the mall without a mask, making a TikTok to the audio that is just like, hope, 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 I love hope in Russian. <laughs> what fucking song is it? What fucking song is it? I would love to know, but I've got no fucking clue. What a description. Do you just mean... The music in the background, in general, or this particular song? I'm as confused as you are, Kai. Thank you. I, I saw- I saw that TikTok because Timaki sent it to me earlier. Yeah! <laughs> nice! Woo! You did it! Sorry. Oh, I'm sorry. The coconuts. I'm sorry you're having trouble, June. I'm sorry. I just I just really went off. Like my brain, I just I don't know what happened. My brain just kind of did that. I hope you appreciated my celebratory sounds. I watermelon. Yes. Yes. Oh. Yes, gamers, we did it. Yes. Oh my god. Maybe I'll do a water melon fusion stream someday. I try to. You I would love that. You should absolutely do it. Okay, if Peapot Indulgence tries to friend you, don't be scared. <laughs> I will be, and that's a promise. I can't check my normal Discord right now because uh, it's on my phone, and I'm on my phone. So if you send it, send it to my VTube Discord. I also indulge in pee paws. That feels like a threat. I'm glad for you, though. <laughs> Man. My first watermelon on stream and during my first round. I feel such a rush right now. Oh, man. I feel like I just chugged a whole monster energy drink. Not even that. I feel like I just snorted a monster energy drink. In powdered form. Yeah, baby. That's how I feel right now. Exactly. Thank you. I don't know. It kind of sounds like it would give you cancer or like kill you instantly. Yeah. Yeah. But that's fine. My brain is too powerful for that. Thank you. I will accept. Wow. I am so afraid to watch this video. You are about to probably hear it, because, you know, I will mute the desktop audio. Yeah, now you guys don't get to know. That person that walked by and felt the need to pose with, with Nogito Kamida in the mall is... terrifying. That is all I have to say. Oh, two watermelons! I have two whole watermelons! June, I'm so proud of you right now. <laughs> you, you deserve... <laughs> you deserve your watermelons. Good luck with your stream, Arca. I okay. Will be I love you, you. Arca. I love, I love you. I'll miss you. I'll be thinking of you in the moments where I am not encountering you here. In the, the moment between when I am encountering you here and you begin your stream, I will be... Missing you dearly. 
Thank you for that awful, awful video, Tamaki. I hated it. I kind of like want to like listen to other music because I can't hear. I love you too, Kai. I miss you already. Oh, What do you want me to dramatically read, Tamaki? Fuck. You didn't think about that, did you? <laughs> You- you just- you just tried it, and then you were like, wait, fuck, I have to put effort into it. Um... Tamaki, give me something to dramatically read. You can think about it. Yeah, I'm- I'm thinking about- let me get a Hannibal quote, okay. I'm thinking about it'd be nice to have, like, music right now. That I could hear, because I can't really hear my background music. But I don't want Twitch to, like, snipe me, so I'm not quite sure what I could listen to. That wouldn't get me in trouble. Sometimes I listen to, like, video game music, because I figure the chances of that getting copyrighted are pretty slim. You should listen to the more <gasps> audio film that sounds bad. One and a half, baby! I do not like the way this is going, though. I do not like the way this is going at all. Oh no. Th that's not good. We gotta gap the size of the... Oh. I am so sorry. Here, you will get the permission. Give me a sec. I'm sorry, it's prevent spammers. There you go. You may share. I am so sorry. Thank you, thank you for that. Yes, um... It is to prevent the evil spammer people from coming in. Uh, and posting their dumb little links. So, I wanted it to be like... You know what, I might... No, it wouldn't matter if I give you VIP, actually, I don't think. Would it? I'm not sure. Arka, you could be a mod. I have one and a half watermelons, and it's really, 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 really stressful, actually. And I feel like I'm dying. Oh my fuck, I don't know what to do with this lemon. Oh fuck, I don't know what to do with this lemon. Oh fuck, I don't have... Has, uh, no! 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 Ah! I've passed away. Oh, no. Rip me. Rip me. Okay. Well. Cybersecurity Majima, help me out here. You may not know what my ads say. Oh, this one's... Just a normal one. Okay. Alright. Hello, we're back. Okay, I wanna listen to music. I wanna bop. I wanna bop. We're... Uh... We're gonna listen to music. Yes. I really don't want to listen to the Modalza soundtrack <laughs> as music. I see. I have this playlist, which is just of random Nintendo music. We're gonna listen to that. Yep. This is it. This is the vibe. Yes! Okay. Yes. Okay, let's go. Me channel. Me channel. Yes. Can you read the whole seven condoms condoms found in food script? I'm not quite sure what that is, but yeah, sure, if you send it to me on Discord, maybe. Is that all you want me to read? A 
Okay, so just that message. Yeah, I can do it. Okay. Alright, let me get out. Jim, what is it? Jim, no pedi. How is it said? Yeah. Alright, let's go. <clears throat> Something about seven condoms found in food? Provided by Tamaki Kamikawa. At a McDonald's in Easton, Pennsylvania, in 1999, William Smith discovered a condom while eating his Big Mac. He complained to the manager, who apologized and offered him two coupons. Smith would later file a lawsuit against the company, citing emotional and physical illness. Thank you. Please don't have an asthma attack. I need you alive. I need you alive. God damn it, Tamaki. Sorry, I'm just like jamming out to the Wii channel theme. I, I mean, me channel theme. I mean, whatever, man. Whatever. So I'm a fake Wii fan. Who cares? Maybe I'm a fake gamer. Who cares? I don't know what this is, but it kind of slaps. No! That Kiwi should have gone where I wanted it to. Fuck you, man. It's okay. We, we made up for it. We made up for it. Now this music makes this into a bop. This music makes this stream a lot more fun for me. I'm just, yeah, woo! I don't know what this is, but yeah. We're bopping. Yeah. I can also sing, I guess. I know Ozza sung while he was streaming it. I could be like him, I guess. Don't know what I would sing. Never done a singing stream before. This could just be one, huh? I would have to do the shit acapella, though, because Twitch would come for my ass. Has Arca's stream started? I don't know how I would do a watch party of his stream, to be honest. I would love to, but I'm just not quite sure how I would execute it. Coconut! Yes, you know, we vibin'. Fruit. Oh, I love how that shit rotates. Yes! We got an apple rotating with it too. Oh my gosh, that orange and that kiwi, they're vibing. This song plays in the ward. I bet it does. <laughs> what song is this? I don't know. It's just like a funky little song. Yoshi, it's called Yarn Yoshi Takes Shape from Yoshi's Woolly World. And that's how the song feels. It feels like the words Yarn Yoshi Takes Shape. <laughs> Thank you for the clip, Tamaki. I always appreciate it. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Able sisters, let's go. This shit slaps. Like, you already know. Two coconut, we on our way. Baby! We were asked if someone we find sweet, do we say our partner or our bestie? Uh, do you find both of them to be equally sweet? Also, what partner? Like, 
I feel like you have like a million of them, don't you? Because you're in an accidental polycule. Like how many partners do you, do you technically have? Including the accidental polycule. I don't think we- the other two have accepted me into their hearts. <laughs> okay! I under- I see, I see. Okay. So, so... Only part of the polycule has accepted you into their hearts. <laughs> um, I guess say your partner. I feel like you're kind of obligated to say your partner. What if I say my partner and my bestie? I mean, you could. If you could give multiple responses, I suppose there's no reason why you couldn't. Yeah. Go for it. Oh man, those two Kiwis are rotating in opposite directions. Wow. Alright. Yeah. Set the status quo, girls. I just killed that one. I'm horrible. I'm a horrible person. Christ. Why did they let me out of jail? For my cyber crimes. I don't even know what this song is, but sounds like it involves a beach. It's Bubble Lane from Super Mario Odyssey. Meow, 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 meow. Thank you. Why does the light keep flickering? I don't trust that. Why is the light? The, the light flickered like twice. It was spooky. Did you experience it too? Maybe I'm going crazy. Surprised. Finally, my brain is snapping. Finally. I knew it would happen one of these days that finally, like, the fuse in my brain would just blow and I would just go batshit. I've been waiting for this moment all my life. What relaxing music this is. Love the Moroccans. Yeah. I mean. You're cheating because the iPhone X is bigger. You're cheating. I don't know why, but you are. Just take that. <gasps> Watermelon. Watermelon. Yes, we're making progress. Let's go, gamers. Yes. You know, what's been up with the milk thing in the VTuber community lately? Like... People started drawing cow outfits, and all of a sudden milkers are all the rage. Kind of weird. Kind of weird. A little weird. Just thinking about that. Oh my god, if those two tomatoes don't touch. I... I don't know that I want to read that out loud. <laughs> oh no, someone just came into that! Oh, hi! <laughs> Welcome, we're just having a nice comfy cozy stream. Nothing about lactation kinks has been said in the chat. Don't worry about it. I'm so not doing well right now in this fruit times, but that's okay. That's okay, everybody. Not all fruit times are good fruit times. Not- not all the time. And that's okay. Wow. That was a lucky moment. I was- lactation kink. Holy shit, it's like you knew I was here. Okay, alright. Oh god, okay. Oh fuck. The chat is scaring me at the moment. There's only two people in the chat and both of you have succeeded in frightening me. So, that's great. You don't need a fast- you don't need a lot of people in your chat to have a terrifying time reading it. You just need two really fucked up people. That's all you need. Oh man, we got that one Kiwi. It's rotating. It's- it's rotating. Um, I'm pretty fucked right now, to be honest with y'all. I'm pretty f Oh my god, this song. Yes. 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 Yes! 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 Uh-huh. Let's go. Uh-huh. Oh, yeah. Uh-huh. 
Let's go. Uh huh. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Okay, yeah, I'm fucked. This song! Oh my god! I need to shower but hair dye. I see. I just got an ad for rocks in Chinese. Interesting. Have fun in the shower! How are you doing today, Molly? This song just goes off! The stream won't actually load. All I can do is type in chat. I am very sorry to hear that. It looks like my bitrate is fine, so I think, uh... I think it's just mad at you. I might not stream this the whole time. I might, like, switch to Muse Dash or something later. I don't know. I'm just kind of vibing. We're just vibing. We vibing. <sighs> I realize you can't hear me. It's, uh, I think the bit rate is fine on my end. Maybe try refreshing, I don't know, or using a different device. I love typing. Okay, we boppin', we boppin'. This song makes me so happy. I don't know why, it just really does. Why did I put that kiwi there? I regret that. Oh well. Once again, I'm just not thinking about this by this point. I'm just putting shit down and being like, yeah, fruit! I don't think I have enough ADHD, like June does, to play this game for an hour straight. It has been 42 minutes. It's been 42 minutes? <laughs> well. It just eats your time away, doesn't it? What the fuck? Okay, well. Well, then. Oh, this song. I don't know it, but it kind of goes off. Donkey Kong's Crash Course Stage 1. Ooh. Oh my god, that xylophone goes off! Yeah. I'm in this relaxation class now, right? Because I dropped my writing class. It was the lady wanted me to read a like 19 page article and write a response to it. And I was like, no, no. So instead, I went out and I uh, obtained a different class. Well, and that would be an easy A. And that easy A class is called relaxation. And we go in there, and the lady says, All right, everybody, turn on your webcams. And we turn on our webcams. And then she's like, okay, lay, sit like this, and then we sit like that, and then she says, lay like this, and we lay like that, and that's literally it. It is like 45 minutes of a lady telling us to sit or lay in different positions with our webcams on. So it's like really awkward, because everyone has their webcams on, it's like on a Zoom meeting. But at the same time, I'm really grateful it's over a Zoom meeting, because I can't... I don't have, like, the attention span to be quiet and focus on something, like, so stupid. Like, I mean, it's- the relaxation isn't stupid, but laying down in different positions while saying nothing is not possible for me. I just simply cannot do that. I need to be talking or something or else I- my brain will grow mold. So, it would be really awkward if it was in person because I would just simply implode. Like, period. I can't relax. My brain has too many thoughts inside of it for that, I guess. Um, but yeah, 
So I get to do that now every Monday and Wednesday at like 10 a.m. Uh, that's... So yeah, if you're ever wondering, hey, what's Kai doing on this Monday or Wednesday at 10 a.m., guess what? I'm laying on my bed with my hand on my stomach and my other hand on my chest in front of my laptop while a lady who's several miles away from me, at least, I don't even know, oh, she's a good hour or so of driving away from me, tells me about how to lay, and that's... That's that, I guess, and I'm getting graded on this, somehow. So, uh, that's interesting. Huh. That's kinda... It's kinda how the semester is for me. I've got some classes that actually involve thinking, unfortunately. But, I'm not too worried about them. Maybe I am. Who knows? That's a secret I'll never tell. I've always been the kind of person in school that, like... I just make an active choice to not consider school. I just don't think about it. If I did, I think I would have, like, had a mental breakdown by this point. Like, I literally think I would have snapped! So, instead, like, my favorite coping mechanism is ignoring my problems. So does school exist? No, of course not. I just, like, the moment I leave school, like, the moment when I used to go to school in person before the pandemic, I would, like, the moment I left school, shit's over. I didn't do homework anywhere but in school. I would legit spend, like, my classes in high school doing homework for other classes because I didn't have enough, like, of an attention span to listen to the teacher talking in that class, and I didn't need to, somehow. I don't know how my brain works, but I just sort of do school and it works out for me. They kept telling me that would stop working in college. It, it hasn't really yet. It has a little. In certain classes, I did have to try a little bit more than usual, but in general, my my uh, method of ignoring school because it makes my brain want to uh, cry, um, it's working. So, not that I recommend that. I'm just saying that somehow I have gotten through my educational career by completely ignoring the fact that school exists. So yeah. Music's a little loud for me. This is... I've heard this song. I don't know what it is, but I've heard it. June, talk to me. Talk to me, June. There's no one here. I'm oh, sad. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah. I mean, there's apparently four viewers, but they're not Hi. talking, and I... I just want to have a conversation with someone. Hello. Hello. Hi. How are you doing, June? I am thinking about graphic design. Oh, wow. That's frightening. Yes, it's very frightening. That's- wow. Mm hmm. Hmm. Pretty- pretty- yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Cool. What is this song? Green Greens from Kirby's Epic Yarn. I'm back and angry at men. Did something happen to you in the shower that reminded you that you're angry at men, or are you just generally angry at men? Also, Tamaki, I missed you. Mwah. We got three pineapples up in here, gamers. I might have inha- I might have absorbed, like, the gamers thing. I might have absorbed it. Last night I went to Aquarius stream and she kept talking- She kept calling everyone in the chat collectively gamers. And, like, I was just kind of obsessed with that. And I think I might have absorbed it on accident. I tend to do that. I was thinking- <laughs> I see- um, yeah, I guess, yeah. So it is a topic, isn't it, man? Hmm, I'm pretty, I'm pretty much, I'm not, I'm, I'm in trouble right now. Oh, this song is interesting. Gr Groose's theme from The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword, huh? I've never played any Zelda games except for Breath of the Wild. Man, shout out to the moment I get myself one of them- Oh, we've passed away. One of them capture cards I can finally stream Breath of the Wild. Okay. 
Okay. We're going, we're going, we're going. Oop. He really just chased that motherfucker all the way to the other side. Time to put cookies in the oven. Oh my god, you're making cookies. Can I have one? What kind of cookies? What kind? Yeah, what kind of cookies? This song is so funky. Oh man, Nintendo music. Sugar cookies. Oh, those are good. I love sugar cookies. They're like one of my favorite kinds of cookies. I would say chocolate chip are like my favorite taste-wise, but... I have indigestion because my digestive system sucks and the chocolate always kind of upsets my my indigestion a bit so it's a little painful to eat chocolate chip cookies for me which is really a shame because I do love them quite a lot. Yes, Nintendo music is great. I know a lot of it is composed in general by the same- by one guy, and I can't remember his name off the top of my head. I know there's a few of them, actually. Oh, um, Totaka. Kazumi Totaka, I think, is his name. Love that man. His music is always great. He also does this little funny little thing. Whenever he, uh, writes the music for a game, he sneaks- he has a little song he wrote, really short little, like, melody. It's called Totaka's song, and uh, he'll like he'll like sneak it in as a little Easter egg in a lot of the games that he makes the music for. And also KK Slider, the little naked dog that plays music in Animal Crossing, is is based off of him. So there you go. There's the facts of the day, straight from the depths of my brain. It's like fresh out of the oven. Facts from Kai's brain. That's well. That's the kind of knowledge I store in there. I don't know about you guys, but I only store random knowledge that uh, corresponds to my really, really specific interests that nobody else that I know is interested in. So sometimes I just feel the need to dump all of it out, and everyone around me is like, "Okay, that's yeah, that's my specialty." Hmm. The cubital tunnel really said fingers numb, though. That's what she said. Okay, well, let's change the way we sit in. I am using my phone. I don't need to set it on my desk. I can just use it in my lap like I normally do. Maybe that won't strain my elbows as much. My stupid, sensitive, special snowflake elbows that think they are so special that they only can be kept at certain angles or else they make my fingers all numb. <laughs> Yeah, I need to go demand help. Oh, it is so windy out there. Oh, this song. How to play Wii Sports, yes. Cookies are in oven, congratulations. This song kind of goes off, like, but not like, it doesn't like slap, it's just like, yes. You know? I'm not thinking about my choices in this game right now, which is not a good thing. I'm just kind of tapping it. Like, I'm talking and tapping my phone screen is what's happening right now. And even though I'm noting that I'm not thinking about it, I did not change the fa that fact at all. While talking about the fact that, I hey, I should think about this game. What is this? Oh man, I know this song. Hyrule Castle Courtyard, Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. We need to Roblox collab, Kai. We do, let's do it. I think, I think that would be great. Or like Minecraft collab. I have Minecraft on this computer, but I have yet to even use it. You know, in high school, one of my friends lent me their Ocarina of Time 3D cartridge. That's how I- that's like, was my first experience of, um, my first experience of Legend of Zelda. We need a real- Mindplex. I don't even know what Mindplex is, to be honest. I did not really see the stream that you did with June. 
I wish I did, but alas, I was busy doing something. Who knows what? Probably having a mental breakdown. I usually have to schedule those, so like, and it, they do take up a pretty good chunk of my day. It's the best. I believe it. I still don't know what that that is, but... Man, there is such a vibe to like... So, like, games that were made for like, the PS1. Or, um, like the N64. I don't know how to describe it, but they all have a really specific vibe to them, and I hope someone out there knows what I mean. Oh, this song. Whoa. The sounds in this song. I wish, like, the face tracking... I, I wish I wish the face tracking was working right now, because, like... This song has got me making, like, a face. Like, I would say the Pog face is pretty accurate to how I feel about this song. I feel like the Pog face. This song makes me feel the Pog face. It, like, hits the brain just right. What is this? Impact Site Pikmin Adventure Tutorial. Oh, from Pikmin. Okay, okay. This song is the Ward soundtrack? I'm glad to hear that, Tamaki. I really love how you, like, took that psych ward thing and just ran with it. I might switch to, like, Muse Dash or something after this, just cause, like, I don't know, I, I'm gonna get bored of this at some point, right? The name of the website, the, the, the sweet one is on, what is it? Watermelon.uz3. <laughs> I, watermelon.uz3, how else would I explain the Russians in my brain? Yeah, I guess. I guess. Okay. What does the cheats mode version have? No, I'm gonna find out. <laughs> this song. Why does my brain feel like this? Like, if you've ever wondered what like my brain sounds like, it's this song. Actually, this is way too peaceful. You don't want to know the things. The sound of my brain is a bunch of words. Send me it, June. Maybe I'll know who I am. Sobbing emoji. <laughs> that Hold was. On. I need to make sure it works. They literally wrote out sobbing emoji. <laughs> like, I did not read that as sobbing emoji for no reason. I see. Rip. Never mind. Watermelon game cheats mode. Ah, uh, I've passed away. Wah, 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 wah. I'm sorry. The pop cat really gets me. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry. If you haven't touched synthetic watermelon, then your life is lucky. You can't stop this thing once you touch it. They're right. This article! <laughs> this article! Yes, I'm talking about the little game that has exploded recently, Synthetic Big Watermelon. In the morning, she saw my colleague's eyes darken, and she still asked me enthusiastically, 
Have you synthesized the big watermelon? At noon, she looked at the colleague at the next table, and their mobile phone screens were filled with colorful fruits and melons. In the afternoon, she saw her colleague go to the bathroom, and she hasn't been back in an hour. I know. Me in the bathroom. Also went there to eat melons. Me too. So what magical power does this simple game have? That night, we were all synthesizing big watermelons. Me too. First, let's briefly introduce synthetic big watermelon. It comes from the Micro Umbrella game website and it's a fun casual synthetic game. In fact, it is like a combination of 248 and Tetris, but the game content has become a melon that everyone loves to hear. Me too. Open the webpage of Synthetic Big Watermelon and you can start the game. At this time, various fruits will fall on the screen, including apples, mango steams, oranges, lemons, kiwis, tomatoes, peaches, pineapples, coconuts. The last big boss is watermelon. The task of the player is to slide the screen, select an ordinate, and then drop the fruit. The same fruit will collide and eliminate, forming a larger new fruit. I every time love the description fruit, of it. Every time a new fruit is generated, other fruits will slide according to the gap on the screen and randomly collide with various bubbles, and then crackle into a bunch of new fruits. The fruit that does not collide and synthesize will continue to occupy the screen space and grow upwards until the top red line is placed and the game is over. Compared with other elimination games, its space has no restrictions, which makes people feel extremely free and comfortable. Except, of course, that there is a grate between the two halves of the watermelon. That is how I feel at all times. <laughs> Generally speaking, the ability to synthesize two watermelons is already the limit. However, many people still firmly believe that it is impossible for two big oh. watermelons to exist in this world at the same time. Therefore, this game needs to test how players best place fruits to form more eliminations and guide more collisions. Want $50 of money, not a scam? Yes! OMG, it's Popkai, the best VTuber. Thank you. Face Rig said fuck you, so I decided to go to use my Popcat avatar. You may continue reading your badly translated article, June. Okay. The most exciting part is that the form of its elimination is not fixed. Sometimes a big fruit falls down and chooses the right place to smash it, which can make which can make a miracle a miracle vigorously and smash a chain synthesis. Sometimes, smash a chain as synthesis. Long as the big fruit synthesis vacates a place, many small fruits will collide and eliminate frantically. Yes, this is Animal Crossing music. We're listening to Nintendo <laughs> music in general. You remember the interactivity when you first opened it. This is it? It wasn't until 3 o'clock in the morning last night that I suddenly realized it's so fragrant. It is so <laughs> fragrant. This game is so fragrant. In the dazzling elimination like fireworks, the feeling of happiness at that moment cannot be described in words. It really Only can't. To enjoy it in the brilliance. It is literally like the best feeling. <laughs> it is like better than sex. And that is a promise. Tips behind the big watermelon. Although it's a small game that doesn't require brain thinking, everyone is doing their best to get the big watermelon. It this is estimated song. that the developers did not expect that this game could be widely spread for a few days without any promotion, and even caused web page to crash for a while. In order to prevent everyone from losing their way in the melon fields and harvesting big watermelons earlier, we also especially sorted out some tips. At the beginning of the game, arrange the fruits in an orderly manner, which can be arranged in one direction from large to small, which is easy to cause continuous synthesis. During the game, if there is no similar fruit, fruit below, try to lean on the side. The game is in progress. Try to put a piece of fruit that is one level off. The game is in progress. Don't touch the big fruits against the small fruits, and don't put the small fruits on the bottom. I just looked at the bottom and there's all these small fruits down there and I'm like, fuck. <laughs> this is Legends of Zelda. Control the height and time. Ocarina of Time. If suitable space and similar fruits, put it in a low position. Advanced gameplay. Timely use of physical mechanisms in the game, such as collision, squeeze, and puncture, to squeeze out the fruit space that can be eliminated. Through the principle of reflection, let the thrown fruit hit the wall or other balls. Thereby changing direction and hitting the same fruit. Melon. This game is not melon. I sent it to you, Valentine, I think. It's called. Hold on. No, it's called Husheng Da Shi Gua. Husheng Da Shi Gua, which uh, translates to synthetic watermelon. 
Um, I, but like watermelon fusion is a better translation. It's, it's like synthesize, synthesize a big watermelon or something. Yeah. But watermelon fusion is the best way to call it. It's like a in-browser mobile game. You know, I was just thinking, the people who developed this game could probably just put it on the App Store themselves and then no one would steal it from them. That would be nice of them to do. Oh my god, this, this article is going places. There are also netizens who leave the game itself and seek the assistance of external mysterious forces. For example, shaking the phone and trying to make the phone move. For example, pulling the edge of the split screen on the computer and then letting go. Trying to make the fruit slide down. For example, playing directly on the tablet to double the screen space. You have to pay money to put your games on the app store. Yes, that is true. Because the longer the screen means, the more fruit can be accommodated. Some people have also tried to use the Google browser to adjust the screen ratio to a limit of 23 to 151, and found that it can reach up to five or 6,000 points, which, in the, which can accommodate 7 or 8 melons. Although, Aza. although I've been addicted to it for a day, I've only synthesized half a big watermelon in most cases, and the highest record is one big watermelon. That's me. In order me. to meet the demand for eating melons, which is in short supply, Juku even has programmer X Azrael to make a magical change to let people directly eat melons. Directly eat melons. Open the game and you can choose the original version, violent melon version, cheat mode version, and so on. With a single tap, the big melons fall from the sky and the salute spreads all over the sky, making people feel happy. More I... Over... What the fuck does that mean? <laughs> Moreover, the respondent also specially made a remove melon version. After all, the highly praised comments in the game comment are, This game should be called the Nasty Purple Grape. I agree that the grape should be removed. <laughs> Although the demo version was changed- Oh my god, this picture! Why? <laughs> Although the demo version was changed to a hot search on Weibo, allowing netizens to call Realize the Dream, but now the demo version can no longer be open because the main OSS data package is exhausted. The unavailable big melon is still in constant commotion. Me too. Why can synthetic big water? My brain, my brain is an unavailable big melon. <laughs> Why can synthetic big watermelon become pop become popular overnight? Some people I've love each passed other. away. Some, Some people, people love each other. other. Some people want to see it night. Some people synthesize the big watermelon and can't get together all day. The synthetic big watermelon that makes people indulge in all day. Although the design is simple, the fruit itself looks refreshing, and it is obviously more comfortable and refreshing than the headache of 24-8 densely packed pack Tetris cubes. Unzip period. Unzip period. Psychological research has also found that red and yellow can trigger people's excitement, blue and green can trigger people's comfort, and purple can trigger people's melancholy, so colorful fruits in these games can bring people to life. Psychological feelings, period. Of course, we also know why purple grapes make people so angry. In addition, the bombing sound of fruit synthesis can also trigger a person's psychological defense mechanism, <laughs> allowing people to effectively release stress and enter a moment of leisure for a short time. The quantifiable short minutes of game time gives people the illusion that they can control time. You float, you feel good, and then you are gone forever. Tamaki <laughs> says, isn't that an Aza quote, the some people love yeah. each other quote? They it's really. Quote from Aza. <laughs> that's really. The thing that he said about the synthesizing big watermelons, they stole that? He said that? I think it must be like a famous quote that he decided to say, and then they thought of the same thing. There are the, there are the reasons why Elimination Games, why Xiao Xiao Love, Popstar, and Fruit Legend are also popular. However, Synthetic Big Watermelon has a deeper routine. The biggest highlight of this game is that it sets up the physical characteristics of collision and rolling according to volume and mass, which greatly increases the game's playability in the silky scroll of various fruits. You will never guess what change journey may happen in the next second, which will bring you into the climax of emotion and the peak of happiness. Yeah. <laughs> That's kind of how I feel, to be honest. This kind of surprise makes people more full of expectations for the game. As long as it is not over, they can always be immersed in this kind of expectation. And when it is over, they can start again easily. This feature may also suddenly burst into a big watermelon when you are about to reach the limit red line. The sudden pleasure was like plunged into the cold waves from a cliff, like a cannonball exploded in the air after being shot. 
I... Terminology, in the terminology of game design, this is called superimposed enhancement program. What? <laughs> <laughs> this article! This makes no sense, and I hate that. <laughs> it refers to the superimposition techniques in this game to allow players to continuously receive rewards while also allowing players to pay more than this one reward. Okay. I... The large amount of luck and synthetic big watermelon is a variable scale strengthening program that makes players unpredictable about the game content and results. When players have the opportunity to synthesize a big watermelon at any time, this kind of unexpected surprise can make the rewards more attractive. At any time. Define can I really at any time? <laughs> at any time you can synthesize a big watermelon. It's not working out like that for me. <laughs> The final score at the end of the game, the comparison with the highest score, in the words, you beat blank percent of the players in the world, have further straightened the player's eagerness to win, allowing the player to have a sense of frustration or accomplishment to start playing immediately, one round, or share to attract more friends to join this joyful arena. I just kind of like love to send it to people and be like, here you go, you have a disease yeah, now. Same. You have a disease same. now, congrats. <laughs> like this game is like, it it's is like a disease. A disease. Therefore, this small game is called Synthetic Big Watermelon, but it accurately captures the little secrets of human nature. <laughs> <laughs> Does it? <laughs> At this moment, in the frustrating melon field, I announced- The frustrating <laughs> melon field. I announced that I would temporarily give up abide by the desire of human nature and continue to indulge in the melon eating game, enjoying this moment of leisure and joy. Life is short, and I only wish to be illuminated by the holy light that synthesizes a big watermelon. Me too. Moment. Me too. That was the end of the article. Life is short, and I only wish to be illuminated by the holy light that synthesizes a big watermelon at this moment. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that article. That's, that's like quote of the year. Oh my god, that article is That's magical. how I feel. I, I love how it's like filled with memes, too. What what an article. What I, an article. The way the memes are in China about this game that are like, to, I, I want, want you gotta play this to have, you know, big water, you gotta have watermelons for the new year, like, <laughs> bountiful fortune of, bountiful fortune for of watermelon. This song slaps, I don't even remember what it is, I know it's Animal Crossing. Nooks, Cranny, Animal Crossing, GameCube. What did I forget what it was? I will read the rest of these. I will You're gonna read the the, all of them? I, I just want to decipher them. Okay. I think this one's a more normal meme. I wonder, like, if they will, like, the company will actually release this game or what? I'm sure they must. It's so ridiculously popular. Yeah, it's really strange that it's like an in-browser game. It does cost money to put at games on the App Store, but like it doesn't to put them on Google Play. So like it's strange that there isn't like an Android version at least. Mm -hmm. Oh, this is a funky little song. Whoa, the song. It's options for Mario Kart Wii. Whoa. I have never had Mario Kart Wii. Cause I didn't have friends to play it with, but this like slaps. Yes. Wow, this song kind of goes off. Like, makes my brain feel some kind of way. I hope I can make a watermelon. Yeah. That's all I want. I'm not sure I'm gonna be streaming much longer. I will play Mario Kart Wii with you. Thank you, Tamaki. Unfortunately I still don't have a I don't have a Wii. So that is a problem. But when I obtain a Wii, we will be playing Mario Kart on it together, and that is a promise. Oh my god. We're going somewhere a little bit. I'm 
We're going somewhere a little bit. Slowly but surely. Oh my gosh, guys. Oh my god, gamers. We're making slight progress. This song. I... Songs are really just a bunch of weird sounds together, huh? Yeah. Songs, a song can just be a bunch of weird sounds, I guess. Is that what you are currently experiencing? Yeah, sort of. I mean, this song is like somewhat normal, but then there's just this part that just had some really weird sounds in it, and it was like, yeah, they can just do that, can't they? No. Fuck. Fuck, 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 fuck. No! Fuck. I'm so upset. June, do you want to play around? Okay. Oh, take care of yourself, Tamaki. Oh, take care of yourself. Here, sit. Okay. Experience the music I'm listening to. Okay. Oh! Way this is going for me. Oh my god. Oh. I'm so sleepy. I think I have to end the stream. Mm. This. And that's so sad. That is so sad. I hope you get some rest soon. Me too. Aww. I hope you understand. I do. I'm sorry. I do understand. I'm sorry to hear that. <laughs> oh. <laughs> This song! Yeah! Do you know it? No. It's from Luigi's Mansion. What's that? It's a game about Luigi and he's got a mansion. He's rich? No, he won it. But it's also haunted, so like... Mm. Oh. <laughs> you really, you're really experiencing this game like you're playing it for the first time somehow. <laughs> I I just it makes me feel emotions. It makes me feel such emotions. <gasps> ah. Oh, that was the wrong move. Oh no. <laughs> the kiwi turning. Oh my god. I'm going. What? Thank you for the hearts, Valentine. Thank you, Valentine. Who is that aimed at? What does that mean? I don't know. What does that mean? I'm just kind of accepting it. 
What? They're so far away. This song? It's like... It's from Xenoblade Chronicles. Who? I don't know. I don't know who that is. Xenoblade Chronicles is a game, not a person. Oh, I see. That is a pretty weird name, isn't it? Never played it. I only know of it because it's in Smash Bros. Mm. Sound funny. Agreed. It does sound funny. <laughs> He's so funny. Whoa. The amount of, like, vibes this song has had. It's had emotions. It's, it's gone through several vibes in the amount of time that it's been happening. And I feel kind of threatened by that. It's me. Yeah, same. This game is not going very well for me. I'm sorry, June. Oh, you went in the wrong direction. I am so upset right now. That was the biggest letdown in my life. I'm 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 about to start crying. Please don't cry. It's okay, June. It's okay. I love you. It's okay, June. Oh. Uh, yes. Uh, oh dear. Uh, Jeez, don't fall. Uh, Jeez. I don't know what's going on, but I'm kind of scared. I feel like you're maybe transforming or something. <laughs> oh, I'm just having a moment. Don't worry. The amount of vibes this song has. This is like for a location of a character of like a of a like it's Riki the legendary hero pawn. I, I want to know wait. what character this is supposed to be for. Oh, that is so unfair. They're rolling into each other. Look at this. Oh my God. <laughs> there we go. Coconut. Coconut. I don't like the creature that this is song that this song is for. Look at that. Ooh, it's like an egg with hair. What? Perhaps that was a mistake. Oops. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. June, I'm so sorry. Oh no. Oh. Oh. I'm so sorry, June. Clown music for this situation. Oh. I'm so sorry. There you go. That was a round of me playing Puchum Dashi Kwa. I hope you enjoyed it. Goodbye. Thank you. We did. Okay. Uh... I will do one more round and then we end stream because I'm sleepy. That's it. Yes, video games. I feel like I have so much to do tomorrow. I have like, I think I have like three classes tomorrow, which is like, wow, what the fuck. Three classes is too much for my silly little brain. I can only do so much, so much for, during the day. And that's just too many tasks, baby. I don't know about you people, but I got a very limited amount of brain power that I get during the day. And like, once that shit's gone, it's gone. Thoughts are over. Thoughts are cancelled after that point.
I want to know what that instrument is. I love I've heard it in three different things. With, like... I've heard it in the Baldi Basics song, the Poppy Biller Performer soundtrack, and now this song. And I want to know what that instrument is. If you know what I'm talking about... If you even know what instrument, like, the sound I'm referring to... Please say something. I want to make sure I'm not insane. That's that one. Like that one that just played. I wouldn't even know how to find it out. How would you describe that instrument to someone? It goes like... Oh, oh. How do you describe... <laughs> I'm insane. Me too, Tamaki. No worries. We're... Never mind, that sounds a little too edgy. I was gonna say we're all insane here, but that definitely sounds a little too edgy. Sounds like a Hot Topic shirt. A little too much for me. Or like a title of someone's Tumblr blog in like 2015. Accidentally reloaded melon page. I'm so this sorry. Image Rip. This really gets me. Does anyone know what that instrument is? It's driving me crazy. I'm going to send it to you, Tanaki. I want to know what that instrument is! The Kamida. No. What a song this is. It sounds like it's playing played by a symphony of toddlers. It really just sounds like a bunch of, like, Elementary schoolers playing instruments. Except for whoever's playing like the xylophone, they've got it. Like, they're like the one person that knows how to play, but whoever's playing that wind instrument has no clue how to play an instrument. Which really makes me wonder how Nintendo managed to make this into a song. Did they ask children to come in to play? Did they take Nintendo employees and say, here, play this song? I'm a hurdy-gurdy enthusiast. It's not a hurdy-gurdy. I see. Thanks. I'm trying to find out the name of a really specific sounding instrument that I hear in a lot of songs. For like video game soundtracks or weird things. Specifically weird things actually. Is anyone here familiar with Popey the Performer? Speaking of weird things. I'm not really that familiar with it, I just know it exists. I watched like one episode of it because I wanted to know what it was and it was weird as shit. I hold my hurdy-gurdy as one would hold their lover. As you should. As you fucking should. I'm really trying to understand this meaning. I I'm just trying to translate the ones that are on this Mm -hmm. Chinese memes are special. And I don't understand this at all. I will let you look at it along with what this is giving me as a translation for the bottom part. That says me and that says friends. I'm like jumping up and down in a melon field. <laughs> 
No, it makes perfect sense. I love it. <laughs> no, like, that's how I feel. <laughs> I think that's a perfect translation of it. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> oh my god. What a... What a... What... I, I don't even know. No, I've passed away. No, I've passed away. I'm so sad. I'm so sad. I'm so sorry. I'm so sad. Well, I'm sorry, guys. I did my best. My bestest. I am like a wild animal jumping up and down in a melon field. Oh. Do you think maybe that's a reference to the honey badger meme? I don't know. It looks like a honey badger. <laughs> I don't know. Good night, everybody. Hey, night. I can't formally raid Arca, but go watch Arca's stream, or else I will come to your home, and um, I, I will take the keycaps off of your keyboard and eat them, like potato chips. So go watch that stream, okay? I love you guys. Take care. Get some sleep. Take care of yourselves, or else I go to June stream tomorrow, or else I love you guys. Good night! And have a good, good sleep, night. Tamaki. I love you guys. Good night.